My destination was Kotlipay, a little island that's now one of the hottest destinations in Thailand. Take off and Bangkok was behind me. Ahead was a week in a tropical paradise. But the journey was just beginning. From 90 minutes on the plane to the closest airport, Hat Yai. And then the van. Satoon is a great spot to pick up a few last-minute local snacks. You might need some sustenance for the rest of the journey. It's another two hours on the speedboat before the crystal clear waters of Koh Lipe are finally in reach. Koh Lipe is an island paradise in the South Andaman Sea famous for its three main white sandy beaches, clear turquoise waters, a jungle interior, chilled out bars, and a friendly vibe. It's situated by the rugged coastline of the South Andaman Sea, and on a clear day, you can see the Malaysian island of Langkawi across the waves. If you're looking for definition of off-the-beaten track, it would have to be Koh Lipe. This Andaman Sea Island is tiny, but it packs a lot of punch, and it's worth all the extra effort it takes to get here. Explore beach bars like Sea La Vie. and the famous Instagram favourite, Zodiac. My idyllic home for the next few days was the Mali Resort Sunrise Beach. to live and work in a very nice part of the world, don't you? Yes, uh, as most people have this normal sort of scenery as their uh, screensaver. This is our natural screensaver, so the office is here. Uh, we get to have this beautiful, beautiful view every day, so it's a real luxury. It's a lovely resort, actually, and um, I mean, there are now quite a few resorts on Lipe. I mean, when I first came here, 20 years ago, there wasn't much, but but now you get to you can stay in something that's that's uh, very comfortable. Yes, exactly. Lipe is at, at it's 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 at a really beautiful point right now, where it's it's a small island. You know, there's still no traffic. There's no cars. You can walk around the entire island. The beaches are absolutely beautiful. Uh, however, you still have a bit of nightlife. There's bars. There's restaurants. There's even a 7-Eleven. Yeah. So uh, it, it, it gives you that opportunity to come here, get away from everything. We're still a bit off the beaten track. However, you get the amenities and the, the nightlife and, and, and exotic seafood that, that you're looking for on, on, on a trip like this. I mean, you, that, that's a nice thing now, isn't it, too? I mean, here, typically, um, what people look for now is, 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 is a nice, very comfortable room, Wi-Fi and so on. I mean, in terms of the resort, what, what do you offer? Yeah, exactly. It, it, it's a getaway, that's for sure. However, we still have Wi-Fi, you know, uh, we're connected to smart TVs and everything like that. So while you have the feeling of being on holiday and being out of touch, you're still in touch. We still, we have a lot of uh, nomads who come and work set up their office here just like I do actually uh, so it, 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 it's a nice combination of sort of the exotic luxury island feel with a lot of the amenities you get at the nicer resorts in, in bigger cities now you are on Sunrise Beach and for those who actually can manage to get out of bed at that time it is absolutely gorgeous Yes, uh, the sun rises right here, which is something very beautiful. Uh, most of our guests 
make it at least one day. They're up. So it's, it's about a 6.30, 6, 6.30 sunrise. People can come here. It's a very relaxing time. You see people doing meditation out here all the time. And then we have straight into breakfast and then enjoy many of the, many of the options that uh, Lipe has to offer. This is a great place to chill and admire the view. When you do have some energy, Colipe's famous walking street is a few steps away. Here you can find bars, cafes, shops, and a vivid array of food. Now I'm told you cannot visit Colipe without trying one of the signature crepes and Ben's here is going to make me the most famous one here on Colipe and that's a crepe with mango so let's check it out. Welcome to Colipe. It's just about. So you are part of a group, aren't you? So you've, you've got a few uh, lovely projects going on in this part of Thailand. Yeah, correct. So as you said, we're here on Sunrise Beach, but on the other side of the island is Pattaya Beach. Uh, and that's where our original resort was built. So that one, uh, you get the sunset. <laughs> so we sort of offer two different uh, options. Uh, Sunrise Beach is sort of the quieter side of the island, a little bit better for families. We've got the pool, so that tends to be this side. Uh, the other side offers a bit more uh, in way of nightlife and restaurants, seafood restaurants on the beach. So, uh, And guests are, are able to come and go to either resort as they please. So if you want to come here and use the pool, you're welcome. Go to that side and have a bit of uh, action before you come back <laughs> for yeah. your quiet night nice sleep that's available. is a tiny island and that makes it really easy to explore on foot. You've got the village and of course all the beaches and the wonders of a national park. Lipe is surrounded by scores of gorgeous islands, so grab yourself a long tail boat and go exploring. Brian, you've got a gorgeous backyard here, don't you? Yes, thank you. Uh, as you mentioned earlier, Lipe is surrounded by tons of beautiful islands, and one of my favorite activities is to jump on a long tail boat and explore some of the best snorkeling, scuba diving, and free diving areas in all southern Thailand. And the, the long tail boats, I mean, the, the, the captains, they know the, the area so well. They know the best spots to go exactly. on Exactly. Even, even, even if it's not a perfectly sunny day, they'll take you to the most beautiful spots. Even on a cloudy day, you can find 
the snorkeling and the free diving to be excellent. I mean, the, the water here is so clear. I mean, you must see so many gorgeous It's fish. amazing, yeah, not only on the long tails, just, just off the beach, you know, you, yeah. you, you, you're 30, 40 meters just from some of the best snorkeling in all of Thailand. Oh, wow. You couldn't find a nicer spot than this to go snorkeling, so let's go. So as you can see, it might take a bit longer to get here, but a destination like this is worth the effort. Thank you.